Thanks for staying with us today. I'm Derek Francis. And I'm Annie Satowski. The farmer's market in Battle Creek opened for the season this morning. Yeah, there are some changes out there, not only in operations, but also to help people who take part in food assistance programs. And our Lauren Edwards joining us live after speaking with one of those organizers. Lauren. Derek and Annie, me and my photographer Jason Walsh, we went out there to that farmer's market because we love food. And of course, anytime there's food, we will gravitate to it. And it was really cool, but it was just uh, very different. People walking around with masks on, some people had gloves on, but everybody was there to shop just in a new and different way. Okay, so here we go. People are anxious to get out there. They like to come to the market, so they're anxious to get back to the market. <laughs> And the Battle Creek Farmers Market is ready for them. Despite the pandemic, they open for the season Wednesday morning. We have to follow some new rules that we will all get used to. Um, we have to make put a distance between our product and our customer. Like wearing masks and standing six feet apart. Organizer Bridget Leach says they even found a new way to do business. 20. We're doing a new cash handling. There's a there's a one point where you bring your currency and your cards and you exchange it for our scrip. Scripts are these little plastic cards that shoppers get at one tent, exchanging their money for it. Then they use it to spend throughout the market, which keeps them and the vendors safe. We can sanitize it. You go and see the vendor, make your purchase, drop your scrip in the, in the bucket, and you're gone. And what's even better, she says, those who are on food assistance can shop here as well. Whether using the standard bridge card or the new pandemic EBT cards, both are accepted and they'll match whatever you have to spend. So, for example, if you get um, $20 on your bridge card, you get those benefits and then we give you another $20 worth of tokens to buy fresh fruits and vegetables. And there's no cap on the match this year, she says. It's meant to help anyone experiencing food insecurity during the pandemic. It's beautiful because you can spend the EBT benefits on those staples like eggs and bread and those types of things. And then you can spend the double up tokens on fresh fruits and vegetables. Leach says they're glad to help and more so they're just glad to be open. Have it going. Every Wednesday 9 until 2 and Friday from 3 to 7 until the end of October. We're here through May, May through October. And that's a good thing because I highly recommend it. You got to come out here. And if you should come, just know it's over at McCamley Plaza in downtown Battle Creek. And if you come, come with gloves, come with the face mask as well. And if you don't have one, they actually sell them there. And again, if you are on food assistance, come as well. That is accepted too. Reporting live here in Battle Creek, Lauren Edwards, Fox 17 News. All right, Lauren, thank you for that. While dining in at restaurants,